This is a preview of a tutorial that I just, uh, well, I completed the modeling for a derived block library tutorial. And what this consists of is creating a single part that contains sketches for, in this case, it's all of the raised panel profiles that are available by Amana. Um, a mana tool um, and I chose them because they were the first ones that I ran across that uh, had the uh, the profiles available on the net with dimensions so I have each one of their profiles here exactly as they have them on the, the net and then what you need to do is create a part take a couple seconds shouldn't but it will uh, hit finish sketch go to manage derive and insert I don't need the parameters, so I'll gray that one out. I do need the blocks. That's the sole purpose of that part is to have a library of blocks that can be derived into any other part. Um, and you can see there's all of their profiles. I can uh, create a sketch. like this and then drag any one of their profiles and use it. I can also go back at any time to the original block library that I created and make changes. I'll make make one just for illustration. Okay, if I refresh this, there's the change that I made. So I'll get rid of this. And this is what I created with it. Um, see, now I got a update. That uh, profile will have the line through it, but it's not going to do anything to anything. So this this part now has, well it's a single solid, but it has the five or six different profile cuts that Amana makes that are uh, connected to it via that derived block. And then I just created some uh, iLogic rules that will change change the profile at will and this uh, panel can be sized to anything it needs to be. This would uh, probably be probably be the best way to uh, to have done the panel for the eye door but I didn't. I can go back and do it though. But that's it. I'll be creating a tutorial for this um, starting tonight, so it'll, it should be on the website within a couple days. Thank you.